is. I honestly am not really a morning person. I'm trying to be one, but I'm not. <laughs> Sometimes I just gotta stay as quiet as I can until I feel ready to talk. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna jump right into our yoga meditation right now, so no talking involved. <laughs> I just meditated as you saw and usually after my meditation I feel so much better in the morning I feel like I can talk I feel like great I know I talked about this in my last vlog but just in case you guys didn't didn't watch it basically what meditation does for me is it just like clears my mind and just makes me have a clean slate for the rest of the day so basically while you meditate you just want to try your best to have a clear mind and not think of anything just let your mind relax just get yourself started for the day you know or at least that's what I do and what makes me feel the best. It just kind of gets me in the zone for the day. It helps me start the day fresh, start the day with a clear mind. No matter what happened the previous day, after I meditate in the morning, I feel like I can accomplish anything and do anything and I'm just at a clear start. I would really suggest it if you guys are curious about it or just do more research into it if you guys want to find more about it. There's lots of like YouTube channels that do in-depth videos about it, so I would suggest that if you guys are curious. Yeah, so after I do that for 15 15 minutes I go on a walk probably like about an hour's walk and just spend time in nature I feel like your morning routine really sets up the day like if you have a shitty morning then you're kind of setting yourself up for a shitty day so I feel like just realizing that and setting the intention to have a great morning and do things that are gonna make you feel good and want to accomplish the day that's gonna be the most beneficial to how productive you are in the day or how happy you are in the day and how your day goes um so yeah I'm just gonna like get changed put some warmer clothes on and go for a walk <music> Okay, so we just got back from our walk and now at this point in the morning, what I'll do is I'll make a smoothie. I'll make a smoothie bowl. I prefer to have that over a smoothie just because I like to eat something. Since it's so early, we don't dive into like a big breakfast at first or anything else. We just like literally eat our smoothie right away, right after our walk. We'll make it and eat it. And then I'll have like breakfast probably in a couple hours just because I don't really get hungry until then. The smoothie bowl ties me over until then. And it also just feels good to put something as healthy as fruit in your body first thing in the morning instead of eating actual like heavy food, you know what I mean? I like putting fruit in my body first. It just feels a lot better. So, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try to give you guys as best of a recipe that I do in case you're curious. Um, I don't do measurements at all, really. I just kind of eyeball it and I kind of know how much to put of everything. So I'll just pick a random fruit. This is just a fruit medley, like a mix. But sometimes we'll do just mango. Sometimes we'll do just strawberries and banana. It just depends. We kind of just use what we have at home. So right now we have this. The one thing that I always use no matter what, fruit that I use, banana, just because I feel like it holds it together nice and it gives it a good like texture and flavor. It just kind of like mends it all together. I don't know how to explain it, but I'll put one banana in and these are frozen bananas, so it keeps it cold. And then I'll go in with a vegan protein powder. It's always a vanilla one with the fruit um, and I'll just put a scoop of that in just to give it more substance. It gives it like a nice tasting vanilla flavor as well and also adds extra protein you know just to get that extra ooh, protein in for the day so then last thing i'll do is i'll add some oat milk i'll fill it up until about like that and then if i need more while, while i'm blending i'll just like add it in depending on the texture at that point and yeah that's literally it it takes me less than five minutes to make this every morning so easy quick and healthy so i love it <laughs> Thank you. 
Also, with breakfast, I'll make sure to grab myself a cup of water so I can get a few cups in right away at the beginning of the day so that even if I fail to drink a lot of water during the day, I'll have at least like two cups going in me at the beginning of the day, which counts for something. Always water with my smoothie bowl in the morning. So now that I have finished the dishes and everything, now is the time that I'll start work or make myself a coffee before I start and sit down pretty much for the rest of the day and work, vlog, just do anything that I need to get done that day. So it's Monday today and I feel a little tired, obviously because it's the beginning of the week, we're recharging. So I think I'm going to have a coffee right now. Usually I wouldn't have one until a little later, but I feel like having one now. So we're going to make one together. I'm just put an espresso shot, so we're going to make an iced coffee i'm actually really excited to make my iced coffee today because i have made a video like a while ago it was just a vlog and i mentioned in the vlog that i didn't like the oat milk that i was using for my coffees and that i wanted to get the one that starbucks uses so i searched up what oat milk starbucks uses and it told me that they used oatly but then i had a comment saying that they use earth's own barista's edition so then i was like hmm we have that brand like at my local grocery store so i was like i want to get that so i've been thinking about how i want to get it but i just haven't like gotten it yet and then yesterday my sister was at the grocery store and she sends me a picture and she's like should i get this and it was like the exact oat milk that i wanted it was just so funny but here it is this is apparently the one that starbucks uses so we're going to be trying this out today so i'm actually really excited i hope it's really good i have high hopes for this shit i have high hopes for it i'm so excited also i need to change out my battery because it's gonna die okay here's a quick recap on how i make my coffee if you guys missed that video where i showed you guys my coffee recipe so i just brewed an espresso shot in a mug here and what i do is i add about two tablespoons of maple syrup straight into that espresso shot so that it like melts down and i can just mix it a lot better in here and honestly i've tried to sweeten my coffee with a lot of things the only thing that i haven't tried is like actual syrups i really do want to try to go to starbucks and buy like one of their syrups bottle like vanilla syrup or caramel syrup or something like that just to have more variety because i've been using ma just maple syrup for so long and it's been like my favorite thing out of everything that i've tried but i do want to order or maybe even on amazon i can order like the vanilla syrups or something so stay tuned for that if i try those so then i fill my glass with ice i'm gonna go do that right now i'm so excited to use this milk I'm gonna shake it though I have like this weird thing that like I over shake and over mix everything. I need to know that it's mixed properly or I just don't feel good about it. Like, I, I don't know, it's this weird thing that I have. Like literally everyone makes fun of me for it. They're like, Michaela, I think that's enough. I'm like, no, it's not. Oh my God, this better be freaking good, okay. So now I fill the milk up. Mmm, holy shit. Oh my God. This is the best oat milk, hands down, I've ever tried in my life. Holy shit. I did not expect that to be this good. Holy crap. This is gonna slap. So then I'll put like that much milk in and I'll go ahead and literally dump my espresso shot in here. Dude, that oat milk is so good. This, oh my God. If this tastes like Starbucks, I'm gonna cry of happiness. Oh, I'm so like, this is like the anticipation. Okay, 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 I'm gonna taste it, okay, okay. You guys, oh my god. Bro, this tastes like a Starbucks. I'm so shocked right now. I'm so happy right now. This tastes like a Starbucks. I'm not even joking you, like, I'm not lying. Stop what you're doing and go get this now. Whoever left that comment, shout out to you who left that comment that this is the milk that Starbucks uses. I love you forever now. Why isn't this all over the news? Honestly, the milk that you use with your coffee is just like is a game changer. So sometimes in the mornings, if I'm feeling I need a kick before I work, I'll put on a song and I'll just literally like unravel. Just makes me feel like I can conquer the day. It just feels so good. <laughs> oh 
All right, you guys, so that was my morning routine pretty much. Now I'm gonna go and work. Honestly, no matter what your morning routine looks like, whether you do yoga or whether you don't, whether you wanna walk or whether you don't, as long as it makes you feel good and makes you feel happy and makes you feel good about yourself, then that's all that matters. You gotta do what you gotta do and you gotta do what feels right to you, right? So my morning routine is not gonna be for everyone. It might not make you feel good, but it actually really does make me feel good and it makes me start off my day on the best foot possible. I do want to say that that I am pretty good at sticking to my morning routine. It is pretty much like this almost every day. Sometimes I'll sleep in an extra 20 minutes and it'll just be kind of adjusted that way but usually it's always like this to be completely honest. Like I don't want to sound fake but I do do my morning yoga every morning and I do go on a walk every morning, even in the pouring rain. My morning routines never used to be like this. This is the most productive mornings that I've had in my whole entire life, I would say. Like when I was going to school, I did not do this. I did not go on a walk in the morning. I did not do yoga in the morning. I think the reason why that I have such a good morning routine right now is because I am in the best state of my life that I can ever be in right now. Like I'm the happiest that I've ever been. I feel like I'm the most fulfilled that I've ever been and I'm the most connected that I've ever been. And so I feel like this is why I have such success with what I do in the morning and during my day because I don't feel the way that I used to feel. I'm not in school and I'm not unhappy. So if I tried to do this morning routine when I was unhappy and when I was in school and when I wasn't necessarily necessarily loving my life, then I don't think I would enjoy it as much or I wouldn't want to do this morning routine. But since I am in such a good state in my life right now, it makes me want to do this and it makes me feel so good to do this morning routine and my body feels like it needs to do this. You know what I mean? So it's different for everyone and it's different for whatever state of your life that you're in. Honestly, just do what feels right is my best advice. Don't put yourself down because you see all of these YouTubers or influencers or whatever doing these like intricate morning routines. Don't put yourself down if you don't do that because I never used to do that. I just started doing this. I've only been doing this for three months now and it hasn't been like this forever. I swear to you, like I used to just wake up at the latest time I could. Okay, I just came outside because my brother came in and I rather talk to the camera like completely alone. I also came outside because it's beautiful today. This morning, the birds were chirping on our walk. The sky is completely blue and yes, it's cold, but it's just beautiful. And honestly, Honestly, once the weather starts to heat up, I think that I want to do my meditation outside and kind of just try to get my morning routine all outside, like maybe even do the yoga outside. That would be literally just beautiful to do everything outside in the mornings because nothing is better than having a warm, sunny morning, hearing the birds chirp. Oh my god, that's just literally heaven. But yeah, so like I was saying before, everyone's at a different stage in their life and you should not compare yourself to others. If you compare yourself to others, you're just going to bring yourself down and it's just going to go into a downward spiral you got to have that confidence within yourself and yes i know it's not the easiest thing like even i'm guilty of going online and comparing myself to other girls it's it's a very easy thing to do we're surrounded by social media we're always on our phones we're always seeing other people that comparison is the most unhealthy thing yeah i've honestly stopped the habit of comparing myself because it never did me good. It just lowered my confidence within myself and it made me feel so unworthy of anything. Don't compare yourself to someone if they have a good morning routine and you don't because they're probably at a different phase in their life and you're at a different phase in your life. And if you want to make a change to make your morning routine more intricate and you want to add yoga into your morning routine or you want to make a healthy smoothie in the mornings, then do it. But don't force yourself to. If you don't want to, then don't because that will come naturally eventually. When you're ready to do something, you're going to want to do it. So yeah, my my best advice is honestly just do what feels right to you have that confidence within know that you're a boss ass bitch you can do anything you can do anything you set your mind to you just got to have that confidence from within hey so i just came back inside because it was getting chilly outside but i'm gonna end the video off here thank you guys so much for watching please let me know any other video requests that you guys have um leave them down below yeah i really appreciate your guys' support and every single view on my video every single comment i appreciate that so much and i thank you guys so much for watching especially all the way up until this point i hope you have a beautiful morning day evening wherever you're at i love you guys so much peace out